I'm really excited that May is a month that we recognize this very important issue. Uh, as we know, in, in California, we've made great strides to advance efforts for women. I think that throughout the nation, we are seen as a leader in addressing the different issues that are affect our social ills. But still yet, we find ourselves uh, with a lot of work to be done in this particular area. Uh, I'm very proud to be the author of Assembly Concurrent Resolution 53, uh, the Kelly Abraham Martinez Act. I know that her, uh, her husband, widow, is here today. Uh, hello and welcome. But I also see a lot of very caring women that are here with us today that are very concerned. Uh, it's important that we work as men and women together on this issue because this affects families. It affects our households. It affects our children. And what we also recognize here, particularly as healthcare professionals, is that this uh, illness is treatable. It's avoidable. And we just need to get th that word out. We need to make sure that more women uh, and men are availing themselves to understanding that there's a pathway for treatment. We can avoid uh, the worst case scenarios. We can avoid uh, families dealing with a very difficult time uh, through the, the appropriate channels. So I'm honored to be a co-chair uh, with the team here with the California Maternal Mental Health Collaborative. Uh, perinatal and maternal mental health awareness is something that needs to continue to uh, rise in the state of California. And through all of your efforts, I know that it's happening here today. Thank you.